Yo, what is good? My anime pray for what is good. Honestly, this was my favorite show that I found out of everything so far. The Evolution Fruto. Um, that's all I can say. Have a good one. Take care. Oh, bye. <laughs> nah, this show was hilarious. It was definitely the speed I expected it to be. <laughs> it was the speed I expected it to be after the first uh, episode. Sorry, not episode. The first can like the first little piece where he's in the hole and the woman's like hugging him and stuff. It really lived up to that expectation afterwards, in my opinion. So. It's stuff like this that makes you wonder where and what is going to happen. But on the flip side, it is another Izakai. It's a very aware Izakai. And the crazy part about all of that is the fact of how all of the other people treated our main character for him to kind of end up on the side of monsters like yet again with another show we saw like this being moonlit fantasy where sometimes sometimes there's humans and all this other stuff in the world but you're not a part of it <laughs> like his literal descri description and it had barely human and all this stuff so it really felt like a moonlit uh, type of deal or slime type of deal right slime was just literally a slime but was really a human and uh, by absorbing a human could finally create himself a human form but with this show I say it's more like moonlit because even after being sent there as a human being sent there for the goddess being sent there for multiple reasons he was still seen as a monster and that's kind of what i was getting from the kids here making fun of him being barely human making fun of him uh just for him being bigger than most you know so many different things they continuously pushed and said about this character and now here he is fighting for his survival and absolutely trying to get away from these disgustingly powerful monkeys that he shouldn't even be face to face with he should literally be with all of the other students <laughs> so the questions why in the heck is this the way they're going about this you know what i mean like why is it him being stuck out here and if he is stuck out here um what are they going to do to give us um, to give us an information about where things are going to go? And unfortunately, I don't see anybody, in my opinion, uh, breaking that whole entire, like, code of... Um, being nice to him right like they they honestly don't care and if they don't care it just goes to show you that everybody else in this show is going to be in a bad position if they're like hanging out with him which unfortunately i can see happening right like i imagine people just going out of their way to hate on him for whatever reason <clears throat> and that become the thing that he's known for, right? Like being on the wrong side, being hated by his own kind and treated like crap to then become one of the strongest people out there that even after hating on him so much, um, you still... Uh, you know, showcase a huge amount of heart, a huge amount of ways of fighting, and that's what this is. It's getting really, really good when it comes down to me just liking the character and seeing what he can do as a whole, so I am very interested to see what y'all are thinking about this show in general. Let me know. 
and I will definitely talk to y'all in the next one because Fruit of Evolution is definitely one of the only shows right now I care about. I checked out the Vampire one, and I checked out another one, and both of them I didn't really care for, so this may be one of the only shows I drop on Mondays, unless something else shows up later on, or whatever the case is, we'll see what happens. Alright, take care, and peace.